New at six, a Kansas City Councilwoman wants police to stop using videos of situations like the death of George Floyd to train officers. Her resolution passed committee today. KCTV 5 stands for you and our Abby Dodge is at City Hall with a look inside that conversation. In a council meeting last week, Melissa Robinson learned KCPD used a video of George Floyd's arrest to train officers. She immediately felt she needed to make a change. Images are powerful and it's really critically important that we don't re-traumatize individuals. A KCPD captain defended the department's use of real life videos. It would be tragic for us to not be able to use those to teach officers, to teach anybody different points of intervention to prevent those tragedies in the future. If I had my way, we would have no more videos because we wouldn't have this happen. The resolution goes to full council next week. If it passes, it goes to the Board of Police Commissioners, which gets the final say. They'll determine if KCPD will continue to use videos of people who police have killed without the family's consent. Consent is the only exception in Robinson's resolution. I understand that they want to be able to really show like this is what you don't do and this is the reason why. But we have to find a way to do that in a way that doesn't re-traumatize people and in a way that it shows respect for the families and the people who are connected to that situation. For the time being, KCPD isn't using video of the death of George Floyd. In Kansas City, Abby Dodge, KC TV5 News.